Larry Bird and Robert Parrish were key players for the Boston Celtics during the 1980s. They were part of a legendary team that also included Kevin McHale, formed the iconic Big Three for the Boston Celtics. Bird, a forward known for his incredible shooting and basketball IQ, and Parrish, a dominant center, helped lead the Celtics to three NBA championships in 1981, 1984, and 1986. Their chemistry on the court was a significant factor in the team's success during that era. Gentlemen, you just talked about Larry Bird. Oh, shit, that's, that's the main shit. He's like, he's like your Magic, your Kareem, you know, that once in a lifetime player, uh, franchise changing player. That, that uh, the category that Larry was in. And not to mention, I like the way he led us as a team. He wasn't in your face, you know, that uh, talking trash to you. He led by example. No matter how poorly you playing, Coop, he never got on you. All thing he, all thing he would say to you, you know, try to pick it up if you can. You know, you had one of them nights, but things just not going your way. He always spoke, you know, with encouragement. He never tried to put players down, and I always respected that about Larry. You never, you know, he was a trash talker. Oh, to other players. Okay. Oh my. To, oh yeah. my. Wow, give us goodness. a couple of stories of him talking trash. I was just saying. Oh he my doing? goodness. <laughs> One thing, one thing you got to give Larry Bird, he could be red hot or ice cold. He never stopped talking trash, ever, <laughs> ever, ever. I got one too. I, 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 he, he uh, we, great story. Their main man was Tom Chambers, and Chambers was guarding was guarding Larry, and so in, in the jump ball circle, Larry. Walked through myself and, and uh, Chambers, and then came back and told Chambers, I know you're guarding me, and I want you to know something. There's only one man that can guard me, and that's God. <laughs> now, now think about that for a second. Think about the confidence and the arrogance it takes to make that statement. <laughs> think about that for a second. Hey, Rob, let me ask you this much. Uh, there's a story going around where KC Jones was drawing up a play, and you guys were all in the huddle, and I guess he was having a hard time saying it. Larry told him, hey, give me the ball, and the rest of you guys get the hell out the way. <laughs> Is that true? That, the, the story behind that, Kevin was the one that had the hot hand. But as we all know, Larry's the man, and that's Larry's team. So Larry should take the first shot. But KC was torn between drawing up something for Kevin because he had the hot hand and not offending Larry. So Larry just took the F over. Draw, draw up a play for me and give me the ball and get out of my way. And that was the end <laughs> of the X and O's. <laughs>